Herman Cain has some thoughts on Donald Trump's speech and his teleprompter. Let's watch. That speech last night. I thought the speech was absolutely right on and spot on, and it set exactly the tone that he needs to set. Now, a lot of people are going to make a big deal out of the fact that he used a teleprompter so he could stay on message, and he did a good job. He wouldn't have read the information on the teleprompter if he didn't agree with it. Obviously, he did. Now, they're going to make a, when I said they, not y'all, other people are going to make a big deal out of the fact that he was using a teleprompter. We have a teleprompter president we've had for the last seven years. So Donald Trump finally uses one to make sure that he is clear, concise, and pivoting to what's important. And I think that's why that was such a great speech. That was awesome. So he made it seem like a gotcha when in reality it's a gotcha against Donald Trump and it's a gotcha against all the conservatives who have made that argument, which is many of them. So I know for some of you who are late to this or you didn't follow it all along, a, a huge line of attack that the goofball Republicans used against Obama all along was that, ha, teleprompter president, see? Sure, he reads a good speech, but he's reading it, so it doesn't count. Teleprompters are so stupid. You need a teleprompter? Ha, 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 it's an asshole, asshole, asshole. <laughs> Donald Trump uses a teleprompter, and they're like, I think the speech was fantastic. Am I allowed to, is that uh, on PC for me to do a Herman Cain impression? Because I really don't care, I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> I like that he did, uh, he used a teleprompter, and for those who are angry about him using a teleprompter, I tell you, we got a teleprompter president right now. Except, no, wait. <laughs> Nobody on the left made the argument that, aha, teleprompters are stupid. You made the argument that teleprompters are stupid. And then you use a teleprompter. So we're pointing out your hypocrisy. Donald Trump himself hit Obama over the fact that he uses a teleprompter. And then he uses a teleprompter. So yeah, we're pointing that out because he's a fucking gigantic hypocrite. Teleprompter, so bad, so stupid, so bad. When they use it, but when I use it, tremendous. We are winning with the teleprompter. It is a tremendous teleprompter. We are winning. No, see, you are hypocrites. But I love how he flips it like it's a gotcha against liberals. We gotta one. We wouldn't attack Donald Trump for using a fucking teleprompter if Trump didn't attack Obama for using a fucking teleprompter. We're pointing out that he's a hypocrite. But he's like, no, mental jujitsu. He's like, oh, you see, he's using the teleprompter, but we got a teleprompter president right now. Oh, but you're the ones who don't like the teleprompters. We never said that. And then, uh, honestly, I think the best part of that entire thing was when <laughs> Herman Cain thought it was necessary to tell us that he agrees with what he's reading in his own speech. <laughs> you know, was, I think it was a fantastic speech, and I'm here to tell y'all that obviously he agrees with what he was reading in his speech in the teleprompter. <laughs> oh, really? I, I didn't know that. I thought he was reading it because he wanted to represent uh, what somebody else allegedly thinks on the issues. <laughs> like that, to him, that's a defense. It's okay when when uh, conservatives or Republicans use teleprompters because when they use the teleprompters, you have to understand that they they agree with what they're reading. So it's okay when they use it. And it's and Obama doesn't agree with what he's saying in his. <laughs> None of it makes any sense. None of it makes any sense, but I love how he's just, it's this smug like, aha, gotcha, you stupid liberals. Even though I don't make no damn sense.